Sloodle integrates Moodle, the virtual learning management system, with 3D interactive multi-user virtual environments such as OpenSim or Second Life. Blocks in uh, Moodle become uh, 3D objects in Second Life or in OpenSim and that enables uh, people to uh, interact with uh, Moodle and it's uh, inside a Moodle classroom um, and also there are communities developing which uh, can create entirely new teaching tools. That enables people to uh, explore new worlds and this uh, world we're just looking at now is um, Sloodle Island um, which is a demo island for just showing some of the ways in which Moodle has been integrated with uh, Second Life via Sloodle. Um, there is a tour which you can take um, and uh, there's a explanation of how the uh, learning environments have been integrated. Moving on you can see that if you were involved in a classroom you've got control over your interaction being noticed and um, you can uh, scratch your head or uh, change your expressions and uh, you can uh, put your hand up if you want to answer a question. Um, most of uh, these things are uh, possible. Here we're moving around um, to see a, another thing, another demonstration where you've got interactive whiteboards. Here's a quiz. Um, firstly, before you can participate, you have to be allowed to to take part. And um, here it's just going through the authentication process, just showing that I have got permission to go in. Here I am sitting on a crotchet or something like that and uh, now I'm answering questions and as I get the questions right or hang on as I get a question right I get moved up the scale I can interact with objects I can get instructions on how to use instruments um, from whiteboard displays. I can play keyboards. I can decide to be part of the band. Join in. Here we are. And of course, if there are other people there, they could take part too. Um, this is quite interesting. Off to uh, join a classroom in the sky. These classrooms. Um, have permissions set up to enable you to be allowed to enter so you decide to join if there are other people there they'll be seated and uh, you can take your position there are resources here uh, objects which are lit up as you can see and a whiteboard there at the front uh, clicking on it will enable you to uh, have displayed what is uh, a set of resources specific to that classroom. It's being downloaded now. Um, moving on of course if you find that uh, you're not permitted to get into a classroom because you've got uh, you know, your permissions are not being granted or alternatively somebody flies in from somewhere and uh, they're not supposed to be there at all it is possible that well, firstly they won't be allowed in and secondly that uh, they can be ejected altogether so uh, they can be teleported off the island <laughs> 